Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, I'm Sierra Thursday. Let's take a look at the top stories we're following for you today. Multiple agencies responding to a field fire in Auburn and Williams Township in Bay County, spanning more than five acres. That fire department there says that the fire at Salzburg and Garfield Roads got out of control because of Sunday's strong winds. It started when farm equipment hit a rock in the middle of a field with that spark igniting dry corn stalks. A barn was destroyed and a shed was burnt down, but no one thankfully was hurt. Bay City Commission set to meet today. The agenda includes interviews with four candidates for the vacant 7th Ward Commissioner position. Other items on the agenda, consideration of contracts to build a new electric substation for the electric department and to replace and install a new roof at Fire Station 1. That meeting starts at 6 in the Commission Chambers on the second floor. The Michigan Department of Transportation opening a new replacement M30 bridge it comes four years after the original washed away in 2020 and those dam failures. Edenville Township is hosting a special event today at the southern foot of the bridge to celebrate. The bridge features a wider and taller causeway structure and new five foot walking lanes for people. Let's get you to First Alert Meteorologist Matthew Mondro for a look at our First Alert forecast. Thank you, Sierra. For this Monday, still tracking some dry and slightly cooler conditions across mid-Michigan. One of the big stories through this week, in addition to the cooler, more fall-like temps, is our very dry conditions. Our fire danger is actually at a very high level as of right now. This is on the heels of that field fire near Auburn on Sunday afternoon. So something to keep in mind is that burning is not advised with these current weather conditions. In fact, with some burn bans in place, it's actually prohibited in some parts of mid Michigan too, abnormally dry. So essentially the entry stages of drought across most of mid Michigan right now. Rainfall deficits are going to continue to add up as we go uh, through this week at the very least as we're still barely tracking any sort of rainfall in the forecast. It is just tomorrow afternoon where we could see a stray spotty shower move through the northern thumb or north of the Saginaw Bay. Outside of that chance of rain tomorrow, really not tracking much rain in your first alert forecast here through this week. Highs for today reach up to about 65 degrees or just on or rather on just either side of that mark too by about a degree or two more highs in the low to mid 60s throughout most of the week. We're briefly just back to the 70s on Friday and Saturday, but then by Sunday back down into the 60s with a slightly better chance of rain by then and also through the middle of the week lows down into the mid to upper 30s. So we could actually see some patchy frost a couple of mornings too. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather, and information.